Brothers. Thursday afternoon, while many people are staying home, the Hunts Point Markets in the Bronx is packed with a steady stream of trucks and workers helping to keep our city stores stocked with food. You're very busy, right? Yeah, yeah. Rene Bravo has been delivering produce for five years now, born and raised in the Bronx. He says he's proud to be of service during this tough time. The food's very important. City Council Member Rafael Salamanca of the Bronx agrees and thinks workers like Bravo should be considered essential. He sent this letter to Governor Andrew Cuomo and Mayor Bill de Blasio Wednesday, in part saying, quote, I strongly urge you to consider the management and workforce at the Hunts Point Markets as, quote, first responders to our food supply chain. Collectively, the Hunts Point Markets supply fish, meat and produce to over 70 percent of the tri-state region. Martin Fraser says he feels his job is more important now than ever before. Yeah, I guess so. I guess we're heroes. Not a lot of people want to be out here right now, you know, doing these type of deliveries, you know, interacting with a lot of people, you know, but uh, we got to do what we got to do. Fraser's partner, Nelson Akata, has been delivering food to the Hunts Point Market for 25 years. We're just doing our job, making sure everybody gets what they need at their homes for the restaurants, you know, they, they serving out, take out food now, so. We know we gotta do. We want to get paid. We are supplying the, the food. Stephen Algundi has been working at the market for five years and delivers chicken and meat. The store are busy, you know, and we got more, you know. More, more yeah, orders, now right? I'm doing overtime. We should keep on working. Honestly, we should. Okay. I talked to a lot of truck drivers today, and many of them tell me they're working overtime big time to keep up with the demand and keep that inventory coming for you. Reach out to the governor's office and the mayor's office about this. We're waiting to hear back. But it's just like the mayor said, everyday yeah. New Yorkers becoming heroes. Yeah. Yeah, no question about it. And, and you see them all the time, like whatever they're doing out there. And you, we take it for granted every other day, except if we're in a situation like this. And we just have all to of say a sudden, thank you. Yeah.